Hi everyone, this is Tassan here. Uh, I am going to share a few things about positive thinking in a current situation, how we are going to deal our problems. So as you all know that actually we all are actually facing a very strange and difficult situation because of this corona pandemic. So different people in a different area and different locality all are facing a lot of issues. Many have lost their jobs. Many lost their loved ones and many have lost their business and so many different different situations. So uh, let's not be panic. Let's not uh, think that this is the end. It is. Don't think that you have uh, you are a you are a loser. Don't think that you have you have failed in your life. No, still have hope. Definitely we can come up. We can definitely we can struggle hard and find a smart solution for our problems. So, uh, first of all, let me tell you, life is nothing but test and trials. Every person has ups and downs in his life. As you all know, sun rises in the morning and the sun sets in the evening. So, when the sun rises, it gives us sun shines, it gives a brightness in, our, in, in the daytime. We all do work in the daytime. It is so nice and shine and uh, the pleasant day uh, because of sun, we, we are blessed with it. With it. And in the night, when it becomes dark, we are not. It's so dark. Am I right? It's time for us to sleep. And then, in the morning again, the sun shines in our life. So the same routine happens. The same way life also has a good face and a bad face. When the good face comes, and again the bad face, maybe it will come. And the bad face will not be there for many times many years or many days it may disappear in in few uh, few days they are actually like as days goes by as time goes by so days won't remain the same today we may be happy we may be the richest person we may have everything health wealth everything but tomorrow maybe our darker phase also maybe the bad phase and again a routine comes we should never lose hope in our life and one more thing sometimes we get hurt because of setting up unrealistic goals in our life as you all know fish can't fly it can only swim we should uh, we should aim for a thing we should aim for a goal according to our ability according to our strength weakness and the knowledge we have to achieve that goal. According to that one day, we have to set our goal. If we set our goals beyond that in an unrealistic way, then it's of no use thinking positive and thinking that we will reach the goal. That's not going to happen. Fish can't fly. Fish only can swim. Its ability is only to swim. So don't set unrealistic goal and actually become sad of not achieving it. And let me tell you a small story of positive thinking. As you all know, uh, a very uh, famous personality, uh, Thomas Alva Edison, when he was a small boy uh, during his childhood days, um, after turning back from his school, uh, the teacher gave him a letter uh, stating that actually you hand over this to your mother. So uh, he came back home and he handed over the letter to his mother. The mother, after reading it, actually the tears was rolling around from her eyes. The son asked actually my mother what was that. So the mother stated with a smiling face that actually you are so brilliant, you are so genius. The school doesn't have the facility to take care of you and to give you education. So here henceforth I am going to take care of you, she told. And from then after actually she was the teacher for Thomas Alva Edison and as days passed by actually she passed away and Thomas Alva Edison became a uh, greatest scientist of century and he invented light, telephone and many more things. Mm, as days back, uh, goes by, actually passed by, uh, he uh, saw a letter in his closet, in, uh, in his closet, the same letter which the teacher gave him a long time back. So when he read that, it was written there, your son is mentally ill, we can't take care of him anymore. So this was the sentence written there. But the mother, 
but the mother what she uh, expressed is in a different way so the positive seed what she incorporated in his son's mind made him to achieve his goal he is it's a true fact that actually he is brilliant it's a true fact that he is a genius what made him to achieve his goal his positive thinking the mother told that he is a brilliant the mother told he is a genius he proved it so let's have all the positive uh, thoughts that we we are going to achieve this in a way, we are going to come out of this bad phase very soon as our apj abdul kalam former president apj abdul kalam has told that don't make your problems captain you be the captain for your problems come let rule our problems defeat it and get a solution for it thank you so much for listening to me be safe at home take care of you wear mask actually when you go out wash your hands properly take care of your family members thank you